G'day guys, Lemon Eating Cow here, and today I am back with another Final Fantasy 15 Windows Edition update video. And this time I wanted to talk about a few new pieces of information we have, considering a free demo coming up on the 26th of February. Also, some new DLC costumes for the Steam version of the game, a little bit of Half-Life in there. And also some details about crossplay between the Windows Edition and the Xbox version. So Final Fantasy XV Windows Edition will be fully released on March the 6th, but Square Enix has come out and said that there will be a free playable demo coming out on the 26th of February for anybody on the PC. Now you can get this through the Steam, Origin or Microsoft Store, and they've said that not only will you be able to fully explore the tutorial and enjoy the opening main quests, but you'll also be able to test your PC to see how well Final Fantasy XV Windows Edition will run on it and how high you'll be able to push the graphics options. So we know that the benchmark wasn't perfect, there was a few bugs in there. So this demo will hopefully let you test all of the, uh, the settings in a real-time environment. So you don't have to pre-order the game to get that demo, apparently it is free to everyone. But if you wanted to pre-order the game, you can get it through Steam, Origin and the Microsoft Store. Now we've already seen three different packs for each of these different platforms, but it's been announced today that there has been an extra pack for the Steam version announced. And this is the Half-Life pack. Yes, Half-Life. Uh, we will be getting the Gordon Freeman uh, Hev suit from Half-Life. And not only that, we will be getting the scientist glasses as well and a crowbar so we can bludgeon the hell out of wildlife. Not only will this be unlocked in the main game for Noctis, but you will also be able to use it in the Final Fantasy XV multiplayer expansion Comrades as well. So this is a really really cool option and I am definitely getting the Steam version. I mean, I was pretty sold on it before, but this is definitely going to drive it home. Although you may not want to rush out and pre-order your game just yet, because while at the moment they've only announced extra things for the Steam version, they have said that the extra bonuses for the Origin version will be coming out soon. I'm going to make a guess here and think that we're probably going to get a Mass Effect outfit, I would say, for Noctis and the Comrades expansion. Uh, it would fit pretty much the same, well, roughly the same model as we see as the, uh, the Gordon outfit, I would imagine. I would imagine we'd get Shepard's classic outfit from uh, the covers of all the uh, Mass Effect games. And maybe that like uh, ethereal type blade he gets as well. I'm not too sure if the Windows Edition will have extra content. They haven't really mentioned it, but definitely the Steam and the Origin versions will. But with the Windows Edition having mod options, I would imagine all of the pre-order bonuses will end up on the Windows Edition anyway. So in another piece of news, we found out earlier that there would be cross-play between the multiplayer expansion Comrades over the Xbox One and the Windows version. But Square Enix has actually come out and said there will be save data crossplay over the Windows edition and the Xbox version. So if you already have it on the Xbox and you just want to see it in maybe better quality on the PC and you don't want to play through the entire game again, then the option is there to use your save from the Xbox version, which is a really nice touch. So I guess one more thing about the pre-order bonuses. I'm not really sure if you will get the extra bonuses if you order through another gaming site, say like Green Man Gaming or something like that. As far as I know, it's only through the official Steam site, but I, I could be wrong. But if you want to be 100% sure you're going to get it, make sure you order through the official platforms. Anyway guys, if you did like this video, please leave a thumbs up. If you've got any comments or suggestions, or you want to tell me your predictions for the Origin Extra DLC, then leave it down in the comment section below. And if you haven't subscribed already, then please do so. This has been Lemon Eating Cow. Moo!